Now, folks, I don't have to tell all of you who watch the show, I'm a Catholic, but I'm so busy that I hardly make it to church anymore. It's what we Catholics call holy ghosting. <laughs> and what I miss most about my church is confession. So if you don't mind, I'd like to confess to you, my audience. You won't tell anybody, right? Of course not. Great. This is Stephen Colbert's Midnight Confessions. Standard disclaimer. I don't know if these are technically sins, but I do feel bad about them. Okay, I'll be right back. <laughs> Forgive me, audience. After everything he's seen me do, if my dog could talk, I don't think we'd be on speaking terms. <laughs> audience. Audience, if I like a photo of your baby on Facebook, it's not because it's cute. It's because I'm imagining how you made that baby. <laughs> Good job, by the way. Good job. I didn't think you could make a baby that way. <laughs> Audience. I hate it when people talk in movies, but I still think I should be allowed to hum the Jeopardy theme during the boring parts. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes, audience, I pretend to care about sports more than I actually do. Go sports. <laughs> Go sports. Put the thing, put the thing or the ball or whatever where you want it to be and don't let the other guys prevent you from doing it. I always add guacamole, no matter what kind of restaurant I'm in. <laughs> Spaghetti and meatballs? Toss some guacamole on there. <laughs> Audience, I, I don't have drawers for my clothes. I believe that's what the dryer is for. Forgive me, audience, the most exercise I ever got from my treadmill was dragging it out to the garbage. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes I turn off my car's GPS a few blocks from home so I can feel like an explorer. I still have no idea if aluminum foil is recyclable. <laughs> but if it is, could someone pick this up? Whenever somebody says, good things come to those who wait, I wait a little, then I slap them. <laughs> Forgive me, audience. Forgive you. Thanks. <laughs>